It's like the Kodiak all over again. Don't know how I feel about that. Plans have changed. Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to this 3D Machines vlog. I hope everybody's enjoying their day. As you know, once I hook up the trailer to the truck, it's usually a good time. Is it a new toy? Am I getting rid of something? Am I picking something up? I always find something, don't I? Now, as you're aware, I sold the Kodiak. It went up to auction along with the Kawasaki, the KX250F. And I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing, but the Kawasaki didn't sell, and then the Kodiak did sell. So I don't have the Kodiak, I have the Kawasaki. Now, unfortunately, this isn't a new machine, but it is something that I have to work on. It's my grandmother's machine. And she rips it like crazy. She, she rides the hell out of it. She rides the wheels off the thing. Well, actually, I think she burnt the belt up on it. Well, maybe not her, but some people that were doing her yard, I don't know. Because she's got the pull behind mower. Anyways, Mother's Day's coming up. Her four-wheeler's down. Let's, let's try to hook her up. I installed the battery on this thing. I was given strict instructions from my grandmother to ride the hell out of I mean, test this thing, see what's wrong with that, and then go from there. She said something about the belt, transmission, or differential. That's that. That should be neutral. That ain't good. Grandma, what do you mean it's the belt? The thing don't even start. Thank goodness, the battery's just dead. Yeah, I stole it. You know, this thing might not be the Gator or the Kodiak, but it's still a fun machine. I don't know why she said it wasn't working. I mean, the battery was dead, but... So what I'm going to do is I'm just gonna check it out and then take it up to her place. Hook up her pole behind mower. Give it a rep, see what happens. Just so we're clear, this isn't my new four-wheeler. The only new thing about it, it's a new pain in the butt for me. I'm gonna have to try to fix this. Ah. Stay. If it were easy, all grandmas would do it. This will be the most interesting part. I'd much rather be working on the Gator and possibly putting a bigger engine in it. What do you think, is that what we need? If so, what do you think I should put in it for an engine? There are a couple differences between a four-wheeler and a dirt bike. A big one is the oil consumption. A four-wheeler takes much more oil. I had to stop by and get some oil, and the battery shot in this thing, so I bought a new battery. I need to wash it up. I think that's the problem why it's smoking. It's, it's probably overheating. So instead of working on the Gator, or working on the Ram Charger, I'm cleaning up my grandmother's four-wheeler. Nice. I hit the jackpot. That was a subscriber, his name was David. I guess he was just passing by. That's way better than it was before. That sounds phenomenal. I'm gonna try to get my grandma going. I mean, this thing is a heap. She, she'd believe me if I told her it blew up. Hey, your four-wheeler's blown up. Is it blown up? Yeah. So now what? I don't know. It won't start? It's just shots. So now I gotta buy a new one, don't I? I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with it? Uh, it needs a battery. I'm gonna test out your smoking issue right now. I'll mow some yard. Okay. That wasn't mean, was it? Luckily, my family are jokers. So we can kid around with one another without like hurting each other's feelings. Is your family like that or are you, 
or can't you crack a joke? I know there are a lot of families that are very strict. Luckily for ours, it's kind of laid back. I, I like our family, even though I gotta fix a lot of stuff. taking away all our hay bales. Those hay bales were fun. I, I'm already missing them. They're, they're not even gone yet. Nah, they're taking away all my fun. What? They're taking all the hay bales. Now what? Won't be able to climb them anymore. Uh-oh. It's no good. So your four-wheeler's not blown up anymore. We're charging up the battery for it. Is that a plan? But I know I don't run the hell out of it. I, I so then how is it smoking? Were you letting somebody else? Well, I let the Mormon, the Mormon boys because I can run it. I said, are you sure? Oh yeah, yeah. So the Mormon boys? Yeah. Can I put that in my video or no? Yeah, thank you. So lesson learned, don't let the Mormon boys take and your so four-wheeler out. Don't, for... let, don't let their great I guess, I guess we learn something new every day, don't yeah, we, Nan? Yeah, we sure do. It's, it's kind of like the Kodiak situation all over again, but this one's not a Kodiak. Don't know how I feel about that. Luckily though, I don't own this one. I hope you had fun with me today. We kind of got our four-wheeler going in the right direction, but I'm going to leave you where I started you off. I've noticed that people only pay attention to machines and themselves when they start going downhill. When everything's fine, they don't really care and they don't really pay attention and try to improve stuff. But as soon as four-wheelers die or people get sick or start getting tired or, or getting old, that's when they start paying attention. And by then it's usually too late. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day until tomorrow. 3D Machines out. I think we're working on uh, Danny's charger tomorrow. I hope so. The weather's supposed to look really good. A side note, if you plan on moving to New York State and you like to be outside, don't move to New York State. If you want an office job, come to New York State. Stay froggy fresh. 3D Machines out.